Hey guys, it's Ginny and Nancy here with another live tutorial. We have a brand new setup here. I'm gonna go ahead and zoom in a little bit on this one. There we go. Perfect. So awesome stuff here. We got a brand new setup so you can see everything. Um, Instagram probably isn't gonna be able to see as much as Facebook just because of the way that we have to do the phones. But don't worry, you're gonna see everything I'm doing here. I'll just have to show you guys the kit because you guys can only see the gold right now, <laughs> which is fine. So we're going to do another Crystal Pixie inspired look for Lion King. I'm going to do something akin to the Pride Lands. I'm going to be using the yellow and the green here. We're going to do a look with that. And then I'm going to do something similar to the night sky when Mufasa talks to Simba. So we're going to do that as well. Um, we just need some nail tips, which we also didn't have, Nancy. We were oh, trying to set up before we went live, but we missed it yeah, out. That's it right here. <laughs> okay. Do you have some stands for me? I did. That's one. Oh, here's one. Perfect. I'll just use the one. I don't need both of them. It's fine. So, so again, it was use it out I know. Oh. We were just, we were like, oh, it's so fancy. It's pretty. And he but, was setting us set everything up. Yeah good um can I have a little bit of a file I just want to get the edge of the nail off so sometimes guys just to let you know when you're doing your display nail sometimes there's the, like a little edge here I do like to file that off a little bit I don't like to leave it on there just because it doesn't look finished and all I do is smooth it down I'm not doing anything special to it so you can see now there's no more thing there okay so when you're doing this on liquid and powder or you are doing this on dipping, you are always going to do a base coat and you're gonna cure that base coat for 15 seconds. The reason that you do that is so that your Glitz Glue Gel Condensed will actually stick to the nail. So is that one fuller, Nancy? No, this one's empty too. I think it's at my station. Mm -hmm. I was doing Lion King nails today. Oh, okay. On Shy. I left it all at my station. I got it. So here's our full one. We do actually go through these quite a bit. Um, the first two, I think, took us about, we've been doing this for a year now, Nancy. Mm -hmm. Took us a year for the first two. We just opened the third one. So I would say every six months. But Nancy also, just to let you know, covered her entire brushes and her Nike shoe and all these other things. All so it goes a really long way, honestly. Okay. Got my twin tip brush here, number six gel end. And I'm just gonna go ahead and get a bit onto my brush. And then I put that right onto the nail with my base coat cured for 15 seconds. If you're doing this on gel product, you don't really have to do that. So now that I've got my layer down first, any excess, I'm gonna wipe right back in the pot. Cap everything because you wanna make sure nothing gets cured. And then I'm gonna go ahead and float my top coat on top of that. Thank you, Nancy. And this is our Glitz No Wipe Gel Top Coat. And I'm just gonna float that right on the top of the nail, okay guys? So you don't have to add too much and just be very light handed when you do this and that way you don't have to worry about it being too thick or causing you any issues. I got a hair in this, I can see it. There we go, got it. Perfect. Okay, so now that I have that done, I'm going to swipe the sides of my nail because I don't want it to be too thick. And you can see here somewhere on the underside. And I'm just going to do this twice. Perfect. Okay, so now that I've got that done, I'm going to use my crystal picker, not the ancient one, the brand new one. I say ancient because Nancy did these about a year ago. Then she changed out this tip for the white one. 
but you can see like we keep these for a pretty long time honestly they last forever so that's why we still have this one from like our very first couple live videos hey twin city how are you sweetie so now I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna start with our pride lands nail first and I really like this shape a lot and I'm using actually our gold crystals here to do this and then I've also got my SS in the gold as well. And I'm just gonna randomly place these on the nail. They don't have to be too crazy, but I just wanna have a bunch of sparkle on this. So I'm gonna go all over. Oops. Shaking your tray will actually flip your crystals over, guys, so if you're having trouble with that. Oh, I love this one. So easy, huh, Jenny? It is. It's really easy, guys. I'm just going to use the last one because why not? I like the way that looks. So again, I'm gonna swipe down the nail just to make sure anything that's like levitating is gonna go right back to the center. And I'm gonna do green on the bottom, yellow on the top. So quick tip, if you get this as close, I'm, I was gonna try and hold it, but I don't think it's gonna work. If you get this as close as you can to the nail before you start sprinkling when you're doing your practice tips. Um, just a quick tip when you're doing your clients, you actually just wanna put their finger in the tray and that's gonna look a lot better. And I'm just doing this because I wanna make sure that it's really concentrated and that the Crystals are actually all over the surface here. There we go, perfect. So now that I've got my first color done, I'm gonna go ahead and pour this all right back in the tray first. Notice we have some of them that are a little clumpy together. That generally happens because of moisture there we go. I got it. So this is going to go right back into the bottle for me. Boop. Perfect. Lid on. And then we'll move on to our next color. And this is the yellow, and I really love this yellow. I think it's super bright and pretty. Yes, Maxine, we are located in Pensacola, Florida. So, you're gonna sweep that up for me? What you doing? Perfect, thank you, Nancy. Listen, I am actually gonna try and hold this this time because I feel like I can actually get closer and it's not going to bounce all over the table here. It's so much easier when you're doing it on the yeah. client's nails. Yeah, on the client's nail it is easier because you can do this Look where you like hold it. I know. Ooh, that's and like I said, I'm just so trying to make sure that it's very concentrated. There we go. Perfect. Thank you, Nancy. So now that we've got this all done, actually, all we have to do, the next step, is putting this in the lamp for 60 seconds. So we have our yellow to green. And in case you guys can't really see because of the blue in the background, you can't see the transition very well, we're gonna put this on a plate for you after I do my precision pen. So you'll be able to see that perfectly, okay? Ooh, I like that. It's really pretty. 
And we are using our mix kit, awesome mix kit today. And this does come with 25 different shapes, as well as your 3D in both your large and your pearl. You also are going to get SS in rose gold, and I think this is what, SS16, Nancy? What size is that? 20. And you're also going to get SS20 in your AB crystal as well. And then you're going to get your rose gold charm and bead here. This does come with little pearls inside of it. Each one of these little pots is going to have 10 crystals of each shape. And then you're also going to get your beginner kit. So this comes with your glue gel 5G. This also comes with your two triangle trays and a scoop. And it comes with your crystal picker. Not only are you going to get that, but you're also going to get your pink and white ombre. Can and your crystal pixie so that you guys can actually do crystal pixie all that you're going to need to be able to achieve this look is your own non-wipe gel top coat okay guys so that kit is actually 225 right now originally 249 and you're going to get everything that i just showed you which is pretty awesome. I think both of these two, the Crystal Pixie and your beginner kit together are actually um, almost $80 worth of product here. Both of these, I think this is, what, 37 on our website, Nancy? This one? No, this one. This one is uh, 37, 39.97. 39.97, and then this one is actually 40, 45, so. Both of these together is going to equal out to be about $80 that you get in free product. And then the nail is done. We're going to put our precision pen. So precision pen actually looks like this here, guys. And then this is your big cap that also acts like a handle. In case you didn't know, I don't always show you guys this because I don't typically use it very often. But some people do like a little liner brush more than they like the needle. I've just gotten so used to using the needle, I don't really do anything else. So what I mean by the needle is when this little handle comes off, there's a little red cap. Keep your red cap. Do not ever throw this away. You want to keep that. You can pop it out. You see how it has like a little needle on it. It goes inside of this little hole in this needle. And then that's actually going to allow you to be very precise with your gel product when you're going around all the little edges. And what that does is it seals everything in. Now I'm at the very bottom of my bottle. You can see me squeezing quite a bit to get this to come out. But you do not have to do this. When you get a brand new bottle and you start squeezing like this, I promise you, I've done it before, it's gonna come out so quick and you're gonna be like, ah, why did I squeeze so hard? So please, just be easy handed. There's no reason to unless you're really at the end of it like I am, but we try to use all of our product before we move on to another bottle because you don't wanna waste anything, right guys? So all around the edges here and then anywhere in the center that you think there's not enough crystal pixie holding everything together, you just want to stick your needle in the little holes and kind of make sure that that is completely done. And then don't ever get any gel on your crystal. If you do, you can just gently wipe that off and you will be fine. Perfect. So I'm actually happy with the way that this looks. I'm going to go ahead and pop this into the lamp. This does go into the lamp for 60 seconds, guys. And then quick tip, when you're doing this, if you put your finger on the needle when you're putting the cap on, it's a lot easier to guide that in place. So I'm gonna pop this in the lamp really quick. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to give us a call. We are at 206-771. 5086 or you can give us an email at info at glitz and such.com and then any other inquiries maybe you don't want to call us you don't want to give us an email you can always just message us on facebook or instagram at glitz accessories and such and my personal instagram is tall hopper or jeanette whitehead either one of those is fine or you can get a hold of nancy at glitz accessories okay guys We got about 15 seconds left on that last nail. I'm really excited to do the next nail. <laughs> 
because I, I had this idea in my head and I really want to execute it. So Nancy's going to get that out of the lamp for us and we're going to put it on this plate here. I really like our display plates because they just add a different element for you to showcase the nail. Yeah, that looks really pretty. So here is our green and yellow. And I really, I think this really captures the Pride Lands. I like the gold. It kind of reminds me, the lions are like this really, it's not like a yellow yellow. It is like a gold and a yellow color. Okay, so now that we've got that one done, we're going to move on to the next one, which I'm really excited about. Again, starting out, I am going to use my clear nail tip. But I'm not dropping everything on the ground. Can I have the sand, Nancy? And then first, guys, I'm going to file this edge off here. And this is just on our display tips. And it's because I don't really like there to be an edge right there. Perfect. So when you're doing this on your liquid and powder, you're doing this on your dipping, please make sure that you're doing a base coat of 15 seconds cured, okay? Then you can go straight into your glue gel. Your condensed glue gel is really the key factor in holding everything together, but you want to pair it with your top coat. If you're not putting this and then this on top, I promise you your crystals are not going to be encapsulated on the sides and they will fall off. So make sure you're doing every step that I show you. You're gonna get your twin tip brush with your number six gel end here. You're going to get a generous amount, but you're not gonna use all of this. You just wanna have an excess amount because you wanna make sure that when your clients have a longer nail, you can go down the entire length of the nail without having to go back in your pot and get more because you can always wipe everything back into the pot you can see I did not use everything that I have on this brush and I am going to wipe that right back in. Recap everything as you go. This will keep everything from cost contamination. You're not gonna get any dust in there. You're not gonna have to worry about it curing underneath the light. Everything will be nice and dandy. If anything happens to your brush, say you got this in <laughs> and for some reason it decides it wants to go curl up on you. If it's clean and you clean off with a little bit of alcohol, you can stick this right into a pot of boiling water or a little cup of boiled water. You can stick it in your microwave for like three minutes. It will go boiling, whatever. And then you just dip your brush back in there. It will go straight. It will go right back to being straight. I didn't believe Nancy when she told me that. And then I did it and it worked. And I was like, oh, foot and mouth. Had to eat my words. Said, I don't know how this is gonna work, Nancy. She said, just try it. Which one? Boiling water with my brush. Oh, yes. See? That's the best trick. That's the best trick, listener. It is the best trick, she's right. So just gently brushing my top coat over the surface of this. And I do see that I got a little bit of gel underneath here. There we go. Then gently swiping down the sides of the nail, any excess, I wanna wipe that off, okay? We are located in Pensacola, Twanda. Hey guys, how is it going? I'm trying to wave to all of you, but we do have a new setup, so it's hard. So, I did my glitz glue gel, I did my top coat. Now I'm going to place my crystals onto the nail. I wanted the moon and the stars. That is so awesome. What is it you call this one again, Jenny? Like the night sky? Yes. This is the Lion King's night sky. I mean, he's talking to his dad, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just like that. Perfect. I love it. You can see I have my bigger crystals on there. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with my crystal pixie. So I wanted to do my metal gray and my blue here Which because I think it'll be really pretty. Which one is that? That one is on it's the gun metal. The yeah. Okay. And then you want this one? Blue. Yeah. Which one go first? 
that one. Yeah, I'm gonna do this one first and then we'll do the blue. You gonna hold it for me, Nancy? So Nancy holding this for me actually kind of mimics us when we're doing it on a client because you do wanna have their finger in the tray and I just lightly tap up and then I dump it on the end. And that way it'll have more of a variety when it comes to your ombre. It'll be just a little more ombre than it was. That's perfect. So now that I've got that, I'm gonna make sure everything is nice off the sides. Tap it down so that it's not sticking up. I don't want this to catch on my client at all. And then from there, I'm going to put this right back into the bottle. And it will go right back in there. You can see I barely lost any crystals because I had that so close. And if you could hold this for me again, Nancy. Perfect. And then we'll pour this. We can just dump it on. So pretty, there we go. Oh, I really like this. Back into Holy the cow. Right back in there. It just goes right back in there. As long as you're easy, you don't have to go crazy and like dump it. It'll go right back in. Something like this, Tawanda, I would charge $30 a nail, but that's really dependent upon where you're at, what your location is. Um, I am in Florida, and so we typically have touristy prices. Um, and then generally the cost of living is a little higher here, so it's just a bit different. Um, it's going to be different pretty much everywhere that you go. And see how beautiful I love this one. Holy crap, it turned out exactly like I wanted it to. It is. It's the, so pretty. Look at it. One. I can yep. hear Mufasa. Oh, Simba. <laughs> <laughs> that was bad. Will you put, you put this in the light for me, Nancy? <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'm silly. <laughs> um, but yes, thank you so much, Tawanda. I really think it's dope too. It's my freaking favorite. I love the gun metal. It's so pretty. It's one of my favorites. In this collection. It looks just like this. It says number four, guys. So if you're looking for this on the website, it's number four. And even if you guys only end up getting your Crystal Pixie, please use your code JennyW because you will get 10% off of whatever is in your order. Um, I don't think that that counts for kits does that count for kits nancy uh still running for promotion i believe for promotion right now just for the awesome mix kit but i don't think that that 10 percent applies to every kit it do it does yeah, it does oh <gasps> okay yep nancy. that is still in uh, okay so it doesn't matter what you that. it does not matter what you're getting on glitz accessories and such.com you will get 10 percent off of all of the order yes so it and doesn't matter your, whether that's a kit or it's Whatever. So in the, the kit, this. the kit actually does come with your starter kit. So you get your glue gel in the 5G pot, you get your two triangle trays and your scoop, and you get your beautiful crystal picker. But you're also going to get your pink and white ombre. And this is $45 here. This is $39.97 here. Mm -hmm. And then you're also going to get your awesome mix kit. And this does come with 25 different crystals. You're going to get 10 of each one of these. But Nancy threw in your giant 3D for you. She also threw in your 3D pearl. She threw in your rose gold here. And then she gave you two different style of SS in the size 20, right? Yes. So you that guys get a lot, really of a lot of variety. You get obsidian, red, you get your gold, and then you get a bunch of different AB style here. And then also them. unicorn. Yeah, mm -hmm. she gave you the new unicorn crystal too. So you get too. everything in that kits and also when you place an order you don't have to worry about with the diamond dust pixies gonna it, come everything's out. gonna come on there so it's if you get the out. awesome mix kit whatever we say comes in it you don't have to add that to your cart it will just be put into your order for you okay guys nancy tries to make sure that it's a no-brainer and you don't really have to do too much work all right nancy am and i ready for precision pen i think i'm ready for precision pen 
Like Precision Simba. pen. <laughs> Say it again, Jenny. Simba. <laughs> I'm sorry, this guys. I'm so. I'm such a. You such have a silly your kids. Goose. Take your kids. It was a oh, great. Gosh, it yeah. was a great movie. We're not going to spoil it for you, but it was really awesome. So when you're doing this, guys, make sure you do not throw your little red cap away. As you can see, there is a needle here. It goes inside of this needle and makes sure that nothing gets clogged in the tip and that nothing is going to spill out of it, right? Because otherwise, you're gonna be like Jenny, you're gonna leave this off, you're gonna put this on because you think that it's good now, then it just spills out all over the counter and then Nancy says, oh no, Jenny, you wasted a whole pin. Ooh, and then I, and then I, and then I felt really bad. Yeah, well, it was fourteen dollars down the drain. Oh, fifteen. What, yeah. Which one? Fifteen. Yeah, isn't this fifteen? Eighteen. Eighteen. Eighteen dollars down the drain. Jeez. Yeah. All right, guys. So, quick tip: when it's a brand new bottle, please don't squeeze so hard. Okay, you just gonna lightly squeeze it. I'm at the bottom of the bottle. So I had to like tip it upside down a minute ago and squeeze really hard. But now that it's like all closer to the edge, I really don't have to put that much pressure on it. And I'm just going to go all the way around all of my edges. I am going to make sure that I get in the tips of these little stars here because I don't want that to come popping off. And that's really going to ensure that it stays on. Anything you get on the top of the crystal, please just wipe it off. When you get glue gel on the top of your crystal, you are no longer letting the crystal have its own refraction from the cut. It is going to just beetle. So I go all around this edge here. I'm just trying to make sure I don't add too, too much because I don't want to cover up my crystal pixie, but I do want to make sure that it's not gonna come popping off or scratch my client. I don't want it to scratch my client either. Anywhere where there's like a little hole here, I do actually try to fill that in because that's where you're gonna have all of your excess issues. Perfect. So all around every edge, guys, I noticed here I didn't go around the edge. Here, right in these little areas here, around the top here. And perfect. Looks great to me. Now I'm gonna pop this in the lamp, okay? 60 seconds in the lamp on this, guys. And then as always, recapping everything. Quick tip, if you put your finger against the needle, you're gonna get it in every time. Except for right now when Jenny is shaking because... Are you hungry? She had, no, I had too much coffee. Oh. <laughs> I'm not even Get done with my stuff. <laughs> This is what happens. So good. Shy didn't want her coffee. I drank it for her. Still, yeah. still drinking it. She's doing a favor for Shy. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just helping Shy out. So again, guys, if you have any questions on ordering, or you ordered and you have a question, or you just have a question, whatever your question is, you can email us at info at glitzaccessoriesandsuch.com. Or you can call us at 206-771-5086. And you can also PM us or DM us on Instagram or Facebook, either place. And we will get back to you as soon as possible. Okay, guys? So please don't feel like any question is a stupid question. No question is stupid. Please don't feel like that. Honestly, I don't really care what your question is. I would just want to help you out. So definitely ask. You never know until you ask, right, Nancy? Yes. Yeah. You never know. That's why even ask. with your clients, you think, oh, she's not going to want this. Mm -hmm. Don't worry about it. I'm not even going to mention it. You don't know that. Until you ask. You don't know that until you ask them. And honestly, I have a lot of clients that are like, I'm on a budget. I don't have the kind of money for this, blah, blah, blah. It'll get to the point where they're going to come in so frequently. They see everybody wearing it. Mm -hmm. Eventually, they're get the bug is going to bite them, and they want to do the really cool nails, okay guys? So please don't feel like asking your clients whether or not they'd be interested in it is the is like the wrong thing to do, it's, it's not. Even if they're not interested, who knows? Like the more that you get into the habit of doing that, the more you're gonna do that with every client and the more that you're going to have people want to do those things and those are the people that you're gonna book. Okay, so let's put our nails on display here. 
I like these. Ooh. Looks really good pretty. These are really gorgeous. So if you missed our live video yesterday with two different colors that Jenny did. Uh, I did orange. one ombre uh -huh. that was two colors and one ombre that was three colors. So if you want to see like a three color ombre, you can always go on our Facebook page and we do post all those videos. We do have a YouTube as well. And we post all of those videos on Beauty for Other Ever with Nancy. Is yeah. that the YouTube? Here, put them oh next goodness. to each other. It's just it looks like sunset. I know. It's so pretty. And then this one. And then this was my Nala inspired nail. So uh -huh. look how pretty so those turned pretty. out. So you any of you was like really hair test to doing a crystal pixie because you know you're afraid of I don't know it's gonna last with our condensed glue gels and precision glue will it sinks hold your down crystal. in there mm -hmm. yeah will hold your crystals last up to three weeks or more and there's so many different colors collections of that and this pixie. One. don't forget to use code Jenny yeah use Jenny. your code Jenny W guys when you're checking out you save 10 and you'll get 10% off. off of your order okay Man, this oh, is so pretty. Good. Thank you guys so much for such a wonderful live video this Friday. I do a live video every Thursday and Friday. That only changes if we're doing shows or I go on vacation. And I do go on vacation in August at the beginning of August, probably like the second week. Um, so that time is going to be a little scratchy. But other than that, it will be every Thursday and Friday. Mm -hmm. Anywhere from 6.30 to about 8 o'clock is when we start. Just depends on how many clients we've had in the salon for that day. So we started a little later today because we had a bridal party leave. And we did really great with them. Their nails look so gorgeous. If you're curious, any of the nails that we do before the day ends, Nancy usually posts them on our Glitz Nail Bar and Spa video. And you can see um, on Instagram. And you can see some of the designs that we do on there. So... Thank you guys so much. I had a wonderful live video and I really enjoy doing these live videos with you guys every single week. Thank you so much for showing up and giving Thank us you your guys. support. We really wouldn't be able Get to do closer. any of this if it wasn't for you. See the whoa, things whoa. Things? That's really close, Nancy. Yeah. <laughs> what about on uh, Facebook? On, yeah. Okay. So on Facebook is right here, Nancy. You shoved it in their eye. She's trying to bling your eyes out. Sorry. The mental oh Instagram you can see is really clear. Yeah, it's so pretty. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much. We will see you again next week on Thursday and Friday. And we hope you have a busy weekend and a good Sunday off. I take Sundays off. I don't know about you. Have a great day, guys. Bye. See, see you later. Bye.